Good morning, guys. As you can tell, it's cold. <laughs> and I'll just let you know, I have a giant bump on my head from yesterday's thing. It's super tender, so it's the only hat that I can wear. But we're going to try and get the rest of these posts up. And we have a few hours before it's going to start raining hard. So that's our goal. And if it's not raining by the time Randy finished running his errands, then he's going to come over and weld. So he came over the other day and we just were not ready for him. So we didn't want to waste his day and sent him home. <laughs> but if we don't get it welded today, today is Saturday, then Sunday is supposed to be beautiful. So after church, we're going to come back and try to get those done. But our goal for today is to get the rest of these posts standing. And we did have a little bit of a mishap that we did not get on camera for you guys. But when we were coming home uh, after running some errands yesterday, one of the posts actually was leaning really bad. And Kim spotted it. And she's like, that doesn't look level. And we actually leveled those. So these on this side, we did not. But those on the back side over there, we did. And so we were able to catch it before it knocked the entire thing down. So we're really hoping that we can get at least a couple of these welded in so that we don't have that problem. But we added more bracing and um, it seems to have stayed. Yes, it did. The wind was pretty bad last night and we are not expecting to, the weather to get any better than what it is right now for the rest of the month probably season. So it looks like winter and fall showed up at the same time. <laughs> so let's get busy. This is also a really good time. If you have not subscribed to please subscribe, we're building this really cool barn. It's a 30 by 50 post and beam barn, barn that I got the, um, plans from barngeeks.com or bar, barn geeks I guess it is a dot com anyway barn geeks link in the description and we would appreciate you subscribing giving us a thumbs up it helps us grow a lot but we're hoping to finish this barn before full-blown winter gets here and we are also milling all of this lumber from our sawmill so go down and check um, the playlist for our milling videos. We really appreciate you guys. Leave us a comment from where you're from um, and all those really cool things and we super appreciate you guys. Man, today's the kind of day you want to start a fire. Okay, string and pencil. You're gonna lay a pencil. You're gonna lay it on this line uh -huh. and just pin it down as hard as you can. I'll go to that end, lay it on that one, 
The mark. The marky mark. These were marked. Okay, there's two lines. Here. There's one scribbled out. I, I pointed as a one. I see. Okay. I was trying to make this easier on myself. <laughs> See how that worked out. needs to come over kind of it. I know what Bob would say. Don't use it as a hammer. <laughs> Sorry Bob! <laughs> draw lines because we got it all. No, we got the lines. How about the center? We don't need a center. Um, no. Okay. Center ends up wherever it is. So we just need to rotate. Um, mm -hmm. I would like to have this bolt going this away. So it lines up with these. That one goes. Oh no, that one goes that way. So I guess we'll, we'll continue on. It can stay exactly the way it is. Get a wet seat.
As you guys just saw, Randy showed up. He's going to do some welding for us. So we're super excited. We're so blessed to have him um, often come over and help us where we need. And so we're, we're moving forward. We're so excited with the progress we've made. Inches. 49 feet 7. Yep. Outside to outside. That's yep. Right. Huh? That's within a half inch. Yeah. Okay, so that one that one has to come this way a half inch. It should be 49 foot 6 and a half. If you're holding in for Oh, it is. Oh, it is. I'm sorry. Now that we're tight. It is actually 49 6 and a half exactly. Okay, what's your next one? Come back. Go to the next post back. I mean, it, that's that's what you plan in. So mark the 10 foot mark, and then we'll adjust from there. Mark 10. I think 10 is right. I think you already marked it. Okay, so this is center. Yeah. So that has to move back. So this is going to be your center. That's enough weld. Okay. That. If we get, if we get an inch or two in from each corner, uh -huh. that's plenty of weld. Okay. Okay, this one is going to move out a little bit. So that center. Yeah, it'll it'll get all that center. This one's gonna move this way, and we got plenty. We're good. Okay. That one's right. Yes. Okay. Let's get to it. Okay, I'm gonna start. I'm gonna start there welding that. So if you want to start setting these to centers, okay. Then I'll just come right down the line. Okay. How are we doing? Should we start? I don't, well, no, that one's braced three ways, so we can pull that two by six off and not affect what you're doing. Affect the corner, no. Yeah. All right, Kimmy, oh, we got to move you, all these. You said you <laughs>
Okay, guys, so what we're gonna be doing is we're gonna be shifting our poles and getting them to the exact space so that they can be welded in. We've re-measured them, we were off a little bit, so we're gonna adjust all these over and hope everything doesn't fall down. <laughs> Okay guys, we've got everything plumb and level, except for our girts. Those are just bracing for now. We will be getting more of those on and um, level and better, but we're very, very proud of what we achieved. Yes. Um, Randy's welder was not, the generator could not work the welder. So we're gonna have to figure out something else there, but we got this far and we'll continue adding stuff to it and We'll eventually get a barn. Yes. So thanks for hanging out with us. I hope you enjoyed this video. Bye. Bye guys. You guys, we finished up just in time. There's the rain. else and you're all beautiful people <laughs> <laughs> leave us a comment from where you're from the ducks are heading to where do they go mexico <laughs> the the geese i mean they're heading north no south 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 for the winter so this is this corner, and those two are for there. So this guy's in our way. We have to pull our string line. There's only two of them. They lost their friends. <laughs> uh, one fell behind, and the other one stayed with it because they're BFFs. <laughs> now they're trying to catch their group or any group <laughs> at this point. <laughs> We need yoga in the morning, <laughs> like regular women. <laughs> All of that time in the service and we didn't learn to stretch before we started our workout. Oh. It's because you don't think it's really a workout until you start doing it and then you're like, ah. Oh.
And I just showed everybody my cheetah pants because it's cold. <laughs> <laughs> to be fair, we both have leggings on, Ernie. Yeah. <laughs> my underwear does not come up to here. <laughs>